Hey everybody, here's another little video that I'm putting together uh, showing off a model that I've done recently and it's a flying high hive torrent turned army that I'm starting because I quite liked the gene sealer cult from the overkill set. Uh, I started the army off with a hiss and a roar but uh, I don't know, I was getting a bit sick of it. I'm just sick of the, the painting for just not really, I'm not going to use them, so not for yet anyway. I'll just have these ready to go and slowly tick them over. I've got a few other bigger ones that I'm going to do whilst I'm doing this, so so many projects from just shelving. It's quite interesting. But th this one I think I'll keep ticking over. They, they look pretty cool. The bigger models, it's amazing. It's amazing to do a bigger model as opposed to the little ones, doing so many little ones. Uh, so this one here, as, as you can see, it's the same as the same colour scheme as the Gene Sealer Cult that's probably on the, the box art and GW. And I, I quite like the idea that the, um, the, the Gene Sealer Cult seed from the, what is it, the prior patriarch or whatever has come from one big hive. You know, it's been sent from a hive and then the Gene Sealer Cult What's it? Does a big insurgency in the, in, in, I think that's what it's called, in, in the, the planet, and then the sends out the sends out the transmission out to the hive fleet, and then they turn up and just take over. <laughs> so I thought, well, why not do it the same colours? And I really like the colours, uh, the black with the blue and turquoise. Um, what is it? Highlighting, and then with the purple skin, which is grey and purple. Which is quite cool, it's, it's quite a cool effect. So let's see if this works, we'll see if there's any sort of... I don't know what it does if I come up a bit closer. As you can see it's a, a flower, it's got wings, sorry. It's got two twin link devourers, I think that's the, the, the best loadout for them. So I bought this model second hand and the guy had already done a bit of a conversion. He'd throw in a couple of uh, just smaller ones on there flip them upside down and then what I did is I just added now this is trying to focus on the front there cracking the little camera sorry team a little bit of the side there we go boom I just sort of added some green stuff and sort of made it a bit more organic around it around both of them there you know, it sort of looks like it's sort of welded. He's got those biomorphs, I think they're called, welded to his arms. Yeah, he looks pretty nasty. He's got that big spike. Uh, and, he's, and this is quite a good, you know, good from the hip, shooting from the hip pose, I guess. Yeah. Uh, from his back, I guess. Have a look at his back. See, it was already glued like that, so you see the spine doesn't go quite up, but it works for this pose. You know, he's sort of leapt into the air, but unfortunately, in the back, they sort of don't line up, but it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter to me anyway. So, you can see, so sort of a bit glossier in the black, still weighing up whether to gloss the carapaces or not. I still quite like it. It was sort of quite hard to decide what was going to be purple and what's going to be blue, blue-black. And it's going to be interesting on a lot of the other, especially the bigger models. You decide, well, what's, is this softer stuff, this stuff here, or is this harder, what's the story? You know, this bit's here. But it, 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 I think it really does look quite cool when you have, it's quite contrasting there so you look on his leg quite neat the purple shining through his through the black and blue I haven't I haven't um, highlighted the the weapons or the uh, like his big claws and stuff yet I haven't decided to do that I don't like I don't really like black edge highlighting as much as uh, so whether I, I figure out a good blend or what, I'm not too sure yet. I'll do it as I as I go, and I might as well show the base. Why not? 
The base again is very similar to all my Death Watch ones. It's going to be, you know, stone with mud, which is quite a quite a neat uh, this technical paint. That technical paint. Yeah, so they work in naturally. I think a lot. Yeah, the base at this stage is pretty is pretty basic. Uh, yeah, I might might want to make them look a little bit better later on. So like this one, I guess. Let's see if I can focus in. Not going to. I'm gonna have to get rid of this one. Uh, it's always so stubborn. You want to show it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, dear, 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 dear. Killing me. I'm not redoing really this one, so I'm afraid you're just going to have to be with me. Um, maybe the battery's going flat. Nice. Terrible, terrible, terrible YouTubing. Oh, there we go, but then it's perfect. I think, think, have to thank all the people that were persevered through that. That's quite terrible. Hmm. But there you can see there's skulls and a bit of goo and, uh, you know, the pipes and a bit of chains I threw on this one. I'd actually really messed up this, this, when I first did this, I put it on the little Terminator base. The Terminator base. And I... I was like, where's the Terminator base? And then I saw this big one, and I was like, oh, what an idiot. So I had to rip it off, and then put it on this one, and then I made this one up. And then the Terminator base was actually sort of already done. So that's quite good. Yeah. So I guess that's a Patriarch. Well, let's have a look at them to compare them against the... Compare them against the Hive Torrent. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah, that would be pretty cool if these were, I guess, are they alloys? They'll be alloys or they might, I had a hunkering they weren't going to be. Like full alloys, like Battle Brothers or whatever, I think that's what the full ones are. It would be pretty stupid if they weren't really, but I guess it's a lot more silly things have been known to happen. Yeah, I think I'll just tick away, tick away at the, the turnids. Um, ooh. Damn it. Oh, that's alright. I forgot I was going to show off these guys. So I did. These aren't sort of fully finished, but again, the black, there's a bit too much black on these guys. Let's figure out focusing on the back of it. Anyway, so these gargoyles. So what I'll do is I'll take you for a ride. At this stage you might want to turn off the video. I'm getting a bit sick of it. And let's have a look at this. Uh, there we go. Gargoyles. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, anyway. Well, I think I'll finish up there. Like if I can make them find too many mistakes. I was going to try and get better, but... Oh. It'll do. See you later.